The surveillance footage shows her making some bizarre movements, and soon after, she disappears into thin air. The police released the footage, imploring the public for help, but it yielded no results. That was 15 years ago to this day. If it's before midnight, they can do whatever the hell they want. No. No! I I've got to get out of here. There's blood everywhere! The building traps the souls of all who die here. Hey, hey, hey guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am here with an all-new game called The Bridge Curse 2. Not sure if I've ever saw The Bridge Curse. <laughs> May have to go back and look about that. But it's called The Bridge Curse 2 The Extrication. Now this is supposed to be a horror, psychological horror type game with paranormal issues, things like that. It is apparently Japanese. I see a lot of Japanese symbolism and characters are all around but it is in English so we're good there now I did get a little bit of an introduction when I first came in here so I'm not so sure we can start this over from the very beginning we're gonna take a look here just in case Okay, this is how it started for me. Sue Lian, former lead anchor for United News, currently working as a reporter. Okay. Well, there was a little bit of an introduction, but I didn't get it, so I may have to get it offline. And if not, no big deal. Anyway, we're supposed to be investigating some ghostly like paranormal activity. Just some strange happenings, that kind of thing. Okay, F. Eh. Gonna ring the bell. Okay, that was a little abrupt. Okay. <coughs> Okay, she's an investigative reporter, so she doesn't want security to discover that she's there. She's not supposed to be. Hey! Who the hell's down here? Alright, the sound may be a little loud. Ah. Jimmy Christmas! Kitty cat. Hey, buddy. Causing trouble, eh? Let me see if I can't turn the sound down a little bit here. Sometimes you don't know until you get in it. Oh yeah, everything's turned way up. 100%. Let's take it down to about 50. And we'll take the master volume down some too. And maybe the voice too, because, well, I think this... That should be alright, that should be alright. Go on, get out of here! Hopefully that cuts... Uh, yeah, it's a little bit better. It's not so loud. Sounds like he might be a little nervous, too. Yeah, when people hum to themselves, they're trying to just get their mind off the situation. Sneak into the building. Okay. Let's see what's this say. A promotional poster for a horror movie shot by the film club. The film is reenactment of the Darren murders, which occurred on campus many years ago. The trailer... The trailer went viral due to an apparent ghost sighting that was caught on camera. 
It sparked heated discussions online concerning whether or not this is just some post-production ploy to get views. Hmm. Maybe. What a trailer. It'll be a hit for sure. Yeah, I don't know if I need to check anything else down here or just strictly go to the building. Well, there's barriers everywhere else. I don't know if that's important, but nope, looks like this is it. Due to dim lighting and the safety hazards that this incurs, loitering in and around the Duren building is strictly prohibited after midnight, at which time the doors will be locked. Please leave the building before midnight. Yes, sir. About two hours. Why did she have to hide from Happy Face there then? Let's close that so we see. T D use your cell phone. Incoming call, Mrs. Wong. Oh, one more thing. If anything happens, don't hesitate to call me. Huh? Now that you're covering entertainment, I'm responsible for you, Sue. All right, already. Get to it. What's this unknown call? Did... did you get it? Hello? What? Who is this? The letter. It was so, so difficult to get to you. Wonderful. Okay, that's creepy. <laughs> okay, well... A horror film welcome event that when when Hua students clearly put a lot of work into the fact that it's held during Ghost Month really enhances the experience. 2016 Carnival of Horror, when Hua's 24th annual recruitment event, 9 7 9 14, hosted by Carnival of Horror's team. All of our activities are totally safe and there's no need to worry. <laughs> yeah, they're emphasizing that pretty heavily, aren't they? Okay. Going down. <laughs> actually, I was. It's actually going down. Maybe. Let's see. So, which way do we want to go? Can't go to B2. Let's go to B1. Okay, this must be the cafeteria for the place. Take a look around. Yeah, I really don't know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> I guess just explore. Okay, let's see. What's Can I do anything with that, or do I have to get back there? Apparently I have to get back there. Wait a minute, there's a door. Nope, can't get to the door that way. Yeah, this is like one of those strip mall, not strip mall, indoor malls where they have all kinds of food courts. That's what it's called. Yeah, food court. Yeah, that's what it is. And you don't see those much anymore. At least not around here. Maybe they do in Japan, but now we can't go through that way. Yeah, there was something behind the counter, but I couldn't get to it. There's got to be a way to get in there. See, there's no restaurant there at all. Empty salad bar. This is probably the actual cafeteria. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, that doesn't look cool. Pot of unknown remains. Okay. Well, that isn't uh, suspicious sounding, now is it? <laughs> Can't open the door either. Good that. God, this place is big. Cow, cow. Vending machines. Now we're back to the elevator. So we didn't really find anything except somebody messing around with the door. I can't get. 
can't jump. Let me see if there's any controls here. Let's see. Graphics, controller, vibration. Graphics. Help. Oh, okay, here we go. To use cell phone, crouch, stand. So we can crouch and stand. We can run. There's a map. Explore and dispel evil. There you go. That sounds terrifying. <laughs> Shift to run, C to crouch. Interact, use item. Okay, so this is our inventory. So let's see here. There's our ID card. Mysterious letter with a safe, huh? Wait a minute. I was just looking on the back. Well, I can't read that. I don't speak Japanese. Let's see if that tells us. Okay, it does say something. Mysterious letter that Sue Lian was carrying with her on the back, written in warped red letters, it reads, To Wenhua University Registrar's Office, Attention C. Luin, Help Me, Wang Ting Ting. Hmm. Okay. Still not much of anything that I've learned. Ah! We can get in. We have to crouch. Let's see what this is. Bucket of chicken? It is a bucket of chicken with a little skeleton in it. What the heck? Okay, that's kind of weird. <laughs> Skeleton toy. Okay, I did keep it. Can't get out this way. Yeah, we don't need that, apparently. Okay, I can't get a Coke. Can't get ice cream. Hang on it. The heck? Why can't I get some food? That sucks. Alright, let's see. Is there anywhere else I can crawl into? Let's see. Nope, that's closed. She must be wearing high heels. Can't walk that way. Ah, here. Here's another place. Nope. It's not open. Can't go out those doors. See, I'm just kind of curious because that... One door opened and then closed. If I'm not supposed to go somewhere else. And then we got that mysterious bone laying over there. Wait a minute, there's something. Okay, what? So I took the lid off. What is that supposed to do? I don't know. Doesn't look like I can crawl in there. That doesn't do anything. Well, hopefully I'll have an idea what those are for later. Alright, let's get on the elevator again. Oh, we can go to B2. Let's see what B2 has. Going to the sub basement. Oh wait a minute, that was where we started from. Never mind. I thought we started with one. Okay. Hey Zan Z Nan, just check it. The key to the registrar's office is in a military instructor's room, right? Yeah. <laughs> so you were serious. 
Whoa, oh my god. I'm not saying that. Wild. Crazy wild. How about that? Appreciate the help and for not asking too much. Post at urgent. High pay, part-time work. <laughs> Look like a scam for sure. I'm investigating a case. Really Couldn't really discuss the details. Again, thanks for your the help. As we agreed upon, I arranged to print uh, for a print interview with the film club. Okay, okay, thanks. Head to the military instructor's office on the first floor. Military instructors on the first floor. Okay, so this is. Where we crouch again. It's kind of doing a tutorial of sorts. What is that? Somebody snoring? Is that the security guard? Yeah. Watching TV and taking a, a nap. Glad he's protecting us. I think he's going back to sleep again. Well, she's spending an awful lot of time trying to figure out how to get past him. Hey! Why don't you go get a nap somewhere? Else? I never get any goddamn rest. <laughs> well. So I better make myself busy. What is he doing? Stealth. Watch out. Enemies will hear you hear when you're moving or when you bump into items as well as other noises in the surrounding environment. Find a key to the registrar's office. Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> well, at least it distracted him. What is he doing? Okay, I can at least see him now. If he goes in the other room, I can probably get out of here all right. He's looking at that girl oh. picture. Nah, ain't no one better than my ball and chain. Ooh, that's close. seeing any keys. Yep, 
Yep, he's going back. Boy, this is taking some careful planning here. Okay, I'm going to head this direction. Because he doesn't seem to be interested in coming over here. At least not so far. Oh boy. No, oh, get some. <laughs> what is his deal? Okay, he's right there. What is he talking about? Well, I hope he hurries up and walks us some way. Classic oldies tape. Legendary campus folk singer from one... Wah, strumming his guitar and singing a classic image that really tugs at the heartstrings of the people. This one's a tape from Sergeant Huang's personal collection. It's a tune that you often hear him humming as he goes about his business. Hmm. Whoa, this is close. Can you believe this? <laughs> he is not paying attention at all. Okay, I'm gonna keep him. Jeez. Now that is what I call stealth, guys. I have managed to pull that off really well. Okay. Now he's coming back. Jeez, this guy is relentless. <laughs> this guy's getting on my nerves a little bit. Wait a minute, there's something over there. Get some. key that opens the main door of the registrar's office is usually kept in the military's instructor's office. Okay, I got the key. Now I just gotta get past Happy Pants. Whew. Okay, I got past him somehow. I don't know how he didn't hear me. <laughs> I thought that's where... I
That was the registrar's office. Wait a minute. Let me see something here. Let's claw. Let's go through here. Guidebook. Ah, headed to the registrar's office on the first floor. I already did that. Military instructor's office registrar. Oh, okay. I gotta go this way. I'm alright. I'm did. I did good. So that's where I got the map. Okay. So I am headed the right direction. I may have to go up and around. I don't see another way in. So how do I get to the registrar's office? I think this is it here, but it's blocked. There's nothing to open that, so let's Try the steps. Okay, we'll try going up. Yep, that's what I have to do. I think I have to just find another set of stairs. Computer classroom. Well, we don't need to go in there just yet. We need to complete the next task. This should have me at the registrar's office. Yep, there it is. Okay. Got it. Just in case the security guard decides to come, even though I doubt he will. He's not exactly totally into all this. Search the registrar's office. Alright, let's see what we got here. We got something up here. Topic Ghost of the in Hexed Building. When what one two four five six seven time eight twenty one nineteen. Looks like campus is at it again. I'm a freshman of Wen Hua. Total noob, I know. I heard that Wen Hua is built on the boundary between some yin and yang zones. So apparently it attracts evil and spirits and stuff. The Duren building was supposed to be built in line with the eight trigrams. But they screwed it up and put them in reverse order. Those jerks messed up the Feng Shui, and now dark spirits are everywhere. The whole thing's haunted, and there's been murmurs about the elevator for quite some time. <laughs> some say you can take it to B3, which doesn't even exist, but I ain't seen any of that. Anyone else has been here for a while? Got any ghost stories on anything? Anyway, the Mad Bell Arena, Cat Spirit riding the bus... Fire Apple, elect general electives that are impossible to sign up for. The Rim Murder, so frickin' scary, error 404. Empty music rooms, go there at night and get ready to crap your pants. And a senior that just graduated said he saw the wrecked necklace consort. Necklace consort? <laughs> oh, there are web pages we haven't read yet. Alright, so there's a lot of reading here going on. Let's see. Your friends and students have observed rumors circulating online about ghosts appearing in the elevator of the Ren building. To prevent intruders from disturbing the peace of our lovely school, our security guards will increase their patrols. Do not speak with other students or the media about these rumors. Together we will squash the ugly rumors. To prevent outsiders from disturbing campus life, please be wary and take extra precautions when encountering anything or anyone related to the matter. Cover up. Can we say cover up? Okay. And info again. 
So, military instructors notice. Friends and students, loitering on campus is prohibited at night. Please remember to do your part in saving energy. Make sure to turn off all electrical devices before leaving. Thank you for your cooperation. In other words, they didn't do it here. <laughs> See what's in here. We got another interesting thing. Classified folder. Ooh, we got a sticky note that reads tape of the 2000 elevator incident. Do not leak. Follow up on the Wang Ting Tang case. On the day that the student went missing, we cooperated with the police and showed them the surveillance footage from the main entrance. We confirmed that she had not left campus. Wang Ting Ting did not leave on campus, live on campus, I'm sorry, and would usually take a bus or taxi to leave the mountain and return home. Based on students' eyewitness accounts, she was last seen at the Duren Building. Once again, it's the Duren Building, just like the dance department incident that happened 10 years ago. The security guard discovered something strange in elevator surveillance footage. After he noticed the higher-ups, they held a secret meeting and decided to only provide the police with the first half of the footage. Everybody agreed that giving the police the full master tape would do nothing to help the case. Hmm. So I can't take it with me. Okay, nothing more, and I can't take that with me, so... Apparently they didn't follow that rule about saving energy. Okay, so what's next? Ah, here we go. This is the safe that she was talking about. Okay, now what am I supposed to... I saw 2,000. I wonder if that's what it was. Couldn't be that easy. That's not it. Wait a minute. Let me check my inventory here. Maybe there was something I missed. Info. Help me, help me. Okay, nothing on the meta. That didn't provide me anything. So I've got a safe, but I have no number. No. So I don't have any way of opening. Wait a minute, here's something. A board with weird shapes. Transparent board with some geometric patterns on it. Looks like there's more than one of these. It also resembles those paintings on the wall. Could they be connected somehow? Well, apparently I just picked it up, so... Yeah, it seems like I need to do some serious exploration here. Okay, there's another thing I can open. Let's see, what do we got in here? Well, I can't do anything with anything, though. Okay, what am I missing, guys? You got drinks. I'm not sure. Well, nothing very spooky has happened yet, just... Let's 
go ahead and close that because I don't know. Oh, goody. I can't get back out. <laughs> that means I got to figure out what I'm doing. Oh, wait a minute. There's where that board's supposed to go. Is there another board somewhere? Okay, let's see here. Well, I didn't see anything in there. And I can't jump. Yeah, I'm kind of stuck here right at the moment. <laughs> Wait a minute, here it is. Okay. Okay, let's see. Probably has something to do with what I'm seeing here, but let's see what we can do here. F? Let me see. All right, let's see. We got. Well, that one matches what's here. But the the other part doesn't match. Oh, we can flip it. Wait a minute. Could that be the combination? Let me try something. Aha! Unique geometric art. It's either 900L or 7006. Which may be the combination. Betch anything. Work of art made by two, two transparent boards that forms different shapes when you look at it from different angles. Why? What does it all mean, though? I think it's 7006. I bet that's a combination, guys. I bet you anything. Seven zero zero six. Or maybe not. Let me let me look at it again. Oh, wait a minute. The colors. The colors. 
Well, it's going to be zero and zero. So green is zero, yellow is zero. I could be dead wrong on this, but green is zero, yellow is zero. This is definitely got to be a seven because it can't be an L, obviously. And if I'm going to go with six, and if not, it's going to be nine. So the red is seven. That much I do know. And I think it's six. That's it. Yes. <laughs> Figured it out. Okay. Lower the locks. Unlock the code in the registrar's office. Let's see what we got here. Your tape? Jeez. Can't believe it's still here. But where the heck can I even play this thing? Ooh. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, come on now. I'm not that ugly, am I? Didn't mean to scare you there, freshman. You okay? Yeah, I'm oh. fine. Hmm. You don't look like much of a student. Bit old, I'd say. What with all that pretty makeup and whatnot. Hmm. Oh. Sue Leanne, I'm a reporter for United News. Well, what do you know? You're that sweetheart anchor from the TV, aren't you? I'll tell you <laughs> what, that screen don't do you justice. Yeah. <laughs> um, anyway, I'm here to interview some students. Oh, this late? Um, yeah. They must be busy or something. Let me see if I can get a hold of them. Hmm. Hi, I'm sorry, but the person you called is not available. Please leave your message after the tone. Not picking up? <laughs> Wait, how can they just leave you hanging like that? This guy's I'm creepy. Sorry. <laughs> Looks like he's busy at the moment, but... <gasps> Hey, Sarge, can I interview <coughs> you instead? No, no, It can no, be no. about anything. Uh, the campus, so. the school's history. Hmm. My boss wants me to do a report on Wunhua. Or maybe you could, like, tell me a story or something? Oh, I gotcha. Can't go back empty-handed, huh? Uh, oh, lucky you. I've got so many stories that I... Um, well... You came to the right guy. I know everything there is to know about Wenhua uh, University. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but I'd feel like a damn fool standing around blabbing my head off. <laughs> Let's go to the cafeteria. What do you say? I'll be more comfortable. What the hell was hmm. that? Sounded like something fell down and slammed into the floor. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let me go make sure everything's okay. You, just wait here. Be back in a few. You know something's gonna happen to him. He's kind of a creeper. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just a little bit. <sighs> Did she get that? Oh, she just dropped it. Okay. Oh, that was close. She needs to put it away somewhere. That was pretty loud. Better check it out. Head for the cafeteria. Okay. Well, we don't have to sneak around, and now the doors are back open, so that's good. <laughs> 